joins us now with a look at your forecast. Yeah, look at a rather chilly forecast. Cold actually out there as temperatures in a lot of locations will be in the 30s. Right now, great visibility. That is going to change by this time tomorrow. In fact, earlier than that, we're going to have the clouds on the increase and some rain moving in. Right now, nothing like that. 42 degrees, winds out of the north right now. Pretty light. We talked earlier how they would gradually decrease as we went through the evening and overnight. So no more worries at all about any kind of a strong winds here in the near future. Although a few days from now, we have another nor'easter to talk about, so stay tuned. Just a minute, we'll get to that. Right now, we're expecting a low in general around 37, mainly clear skies tonight, a little bit chillier inland, a little bit milder right near the coastline. You can see some far inland areas by morning will actually be down closer to freezing, but that water temperature is well up into the 40s right now, so even though it's a light wind, it's hard to get it a whole lot colder than that. Tomorrow then, we're expecting a little bit of sunshine, sort of a hazy sun or dim sunshine. I guess I should say early in the morning and then clouds rapidly increase. And by the time we get to the afternoon, we're going to look at a few showers developing a better chance, though, almost guaranteed we'll see some showers at some point tomorrow af uh, late afternoon, more like evening and into the overnight by Wednesday morning. There's the low spiraling around there that counterclockwise circulation out over the eastern shore and heading east. So uh, we'll have a slight chance of a shower in a few areas, especially to the north. And then most of the day will be rain free before another batch moves in rapidly swinging to the south and the east on the uh, winds uh, coming in from that direction. So Wednesday evening then we're holding in the lower 40s and that leads to a little bit of a chilly day Thursday. High tide coming up in just a few minutes. Minor fl uh, tidal flooding this morning. One inch lower right on the border of minor and the upper end of nuisance flooding coming up here in the next hour and then back down about half a foot for tomorrow afternoon and then relatively the same number just on the edge of that nuisance flooding tidal cycle after that. So that's the overnight hours on Wednesday. Uh, so basically what we're talking about right now, a little bit of a weak system off to the west tonight, mainly clear out ahead of it, 37. Tomorrow, 47 showers likely later in the day, increase in clouds, light and variable winds. That's good news if you're sick of all the blustery conditions. And then a few showers possible Wednesday, very, very early. And then again, a little bit later in the day, Pretty temperate on Thursday, Friday, and then Saturday, Sunday, another developing nor'easter. Won't be as strong as the last one, but it'll get a little windy around here at times, and we'll have some showers, especially Saturday as the storm moves off Sunday, excuse me, Sunday. Then as the storm moves off Sunday night into Monday, we could have a little bit of snow. Saturday snow. I know. <laughs> we'll watch it. All right, thanks, Jeff.